What up YouTube? This is Steven and welcome back to another photo analysis. This time I'll be analyzing the covers of Tana Nishino album Secret Collection and it's the Secret Collection both versions the red version and the green version. Let's begin with the CD only version of Secret Collection Red. Okay, so you notice that there's a door and Kana is by the door. And I like that she has a key in her hand. I think that is a nice prop that adds to the photo and adds to the quality of the photo. And it looks like she has a secret, you know? She's like, shh. And she has the key, so you know, she has the key to the secret. I like the cross legs. Um, I would like to see a little bit more of a facial expression from Kana Shino. Um, and I do like the coloration of the, I like the red color. You know, I guess to me, red represents passion. <clears throat> um, I don't quite see passion, but then again, that wasn't really probably what she was going for. Um, but nevertheless, I do like the color in the photo. Um, I'm not sure if the hat was a bit much or not. Hmm. I think maybe... I guess, you know, she wants to be like kind of like more so incognito. You know? <clears throat> like, you know, hiding herself a bit more. So maybe that's why she has the hat. But, yep, this photo is a nice photo. You're wondering, hey, hmm, wonder what's behind that door, hmm. But it is kind of strange because there's darkness behind the door. I assume that, I guess maybe they photoshopped that, but I thought it was just going to be kind of like the door behind a background. Um, but yeah, I'm like, hmm, secret collection, eh? Mm, what's the secret, kind of? Hmm. No say. I don't know. Um, but on to the next album cover. This is the cover of the CD only version of Secret Collection Green. And I do think the green color is a bit interesting. Um, and some places green represents perversion or pervertedness I don't I'm pretty sure that wasn't what um, kind of was going for with this cover but some people could some depending on what culture you come from some people could see that as like this is a sexual secret but then again people could see the red album cover as a sexual secret as well because red is like passions you know <clears throat> Just wanted to, you know, put that out there. But I don't think that's what she's going for here. She looks really elegant. But then again, hey, who? Do, what do I know? <laughs> you know, what do I know? <clears throat> I like her body position, you know, in this photo a bit more than the previous photo. I like the cross legs. I like the key in hand. I like that she's guarding the door, so to, you know, so to speak. <clears throat> I like the position of her finger. And, you know, the green color is okay. I'm not crazy about the green color. Um, but I think maybe kind of wanted to go with sort of like maybe a Christmas theme, you know. And red and green are colors associated with Christmas. <clears throat> um, so, okay, okay. Um... I like the position of the hat better because we can kind of see her face better in the photo. Um, so yeah, it looks like Kana has a secret. And she's saying, hey, don't you want to know my secret? Or either like, hey, can you keep a secret? <laughs> and I will say that she does look really, you know, classy and elegant in her clothing. 
So, you know, checkpoint for that. Let's continue to the next photo. This is the cover for the CD plus DVD version of Secret Collection Red. Um, her facial expression looks a bit blank. I would have liked to have seen more facial expression. She looks kind of like a doll. You know, not terrible, but I would just like to see more life and vitality in her face. <clears throat> um, I like the position of her fingers on the left. And I like the shh, sh sh sh, you know, the shh look. <laughs> um, I like the earrings. And she does kind of look like she's sort of hiding something from us, you know, by the way she has positioned her hat. So I'm like, okay, it seems like she is, you know, doing her best to interpret the theme. Um, but what let What's, what lets this photo down for me is the facial expression because this is a beauty shot. You know? And it's about the face with the beauty shot. And her face isn't terrible. It isn't ugly or anything, but it just needs more of an expression. And her, well, this is a bit off subject, but her bracelet looks interesting. You know? A big bubble there. That looks interesting. I like the hair. You know, I like the curl, the curly hair that they're going for. You know, the wavy curly hair that they're going for. And I like the hair color as well. So, overall, this isn't a terrible photo. But this photo needs, like, well, kind of needs more facial expression. Or better facial expression in this photo for me. Let's continue to the next album cover. This is the album cover for the CD plus DVD version for Secret Collection Green. So I'm like, okay, I see that she is hiding her face in this photo as well with her hat, you know, hiding part of her face. You now she still is telling us to shh. And <clears throat> she has, you know, her fingers positioned in a certain way. I don't like the earrings that she's wearing, or the earring that she's wearing. I don't really like that. Um, I do like the, I do like the open lip. Um, but this photo is lacking facial expression. And as well, I don't like. I don't really like the green color as much as I like the red color in this photo. So, yeah, you know, because of that, that sort of brings down the quality for me. Um, but, you know, it's a nice photo, but again, I think because of a lack of facial expression, there tends to be that tends to bring down the quality of the photo, in my opinion. <clears throat> the final photo that I'm going to analyze is the or oh, is a promotional photo. <clears throat> and I like this promotional photo because it's sort of it's sort of combining both the green and red into one photo. And I like that. Um, she seems to have a bit more facial expression this time around. So, you know, kudos to her for that. And as well, she seems to still be playing up the theme of hiding something. But this time, she's not saying, shh. So we get to see more of her facial expression here. So that kind of probably helps her out. And plus, this is a promotional photo, you know, a promotional cover, you know. Well, not a cover, but it's a promotional photo. You know, it. This photo was not used on any of the album covers. You know, <clears throat> but nevertheless, it's a nice photo, and I do like the design of the dress. You know, I do like that. Um, as well, I like her hair in the photo as well. Um, so here's how I rank these photos, and I rank these photos as following. 
the CD only version of Secret Collection Red, I rank the best photo. Um, for me, what wins me over is the coloration of the photo. It was a close call, and I don't think that I'm being totally fair because I do think that the um, Secret Collection Green cover for the CD only version has a slightly better body position. But I have to take the photo as a whole. So I rank the Secret Collection Red CD only version as the best photo. I rank the Secret Collection Green CD only cover as the second best photo. I like the body positioning. And I do like the green color, kind of, sort of, you know, it's alright. It's not terrible, you know. Um, next, I rank the red CD plus DVD version of Secret Collection as the third best photo. Um, you know, I think this is a, probably one of her better facial expressions. I rank the um, Secret Collection Green CD and DVD version as the fourth best photo. Um, I'm not crazy about the facial expression or the earrings, um, but it's an okay photo. And I rank the promotional photo as the um, fifth best photo. And I guess for me, um, I think that her doing the shh look probably helped interpret the theme better, in my opinion. But overall, I think these are all nice photos. They could be a little better with, in regards to the facial expression, in my opinion. But I think these are nice photos, and I think that Kana Nishino looks really classy and elegant in her photos. So kudos to her. But what do you guys think? Feel free to let me know. Feel free to comment. Feel free to subscribe. Feel free to give me a thumbs up. Your feedback and support are extremely appreciated and extremely valued. Into the next photo analysis, adios and goodbye for now.